What a stick. Liquid hockey tape. Alright, good day. Today we're going to show you how to apply the uh, What a Stick product, liquid hockey tape, on the blade and lower shaft of your hockey stick. Now, the show reason. Us the can again, though. There we go. What a stick. Can you take a close up of that? Yeah, what a stick. Yeah. All right. All right. Mm -hmm. See, the product could be applied directly on the blade or you could tape it and apply it over the tape. For now, we're going to show you how it's applied over the tape because basically, mostly, that's what the players use. But the thing about the product is that it's excellent on ice hockey, roller hockey, ball hockey, uh, I guess it's a new sport called pond hockey because the product, once it, uh, it gets wet, uh, there's no moisture getting on the tape, so uh, it'll be very dry. Now here we're going to show you how to apply it, okay? We're just going to sand it first, Exactly, right? just basically any sandpaper. Okay, what, what kind of stick is this, uh, Dom? Is this uh, the new graphite? Yeah, these are the new sticks. They're not the wooden sticks. Okay. These are the new kind of sticks. So all basically you have to sand it. Very shiny surface, huh? Yeah. yeah, that's why you have to sand it. Otherwise, the product is not going to bond as well. Now the reason I like to also do it here because the product is also high impact resistant. So a lot of times you get chipped, you get hit from other sticks, the product will be able to bounce out and not leave any marks and also damage your stick. So you don't have to tape it up to here, all you have to do is coat it, but if you want to tape it, you tape it here. But for now, I'm going to Rough it up. And now the other side also. Okay. Might have to use some. I'll take it all back. Now, since we roughed it up, let's see how well it works on the blade without the tape. Because you hate to do all this and then you have to tape it. So here we go. Basically, we have it in different colors. This one is in... There you go. As you see, we got it in blue. Different colors. We have it in white, black, red, can they order any colors, uh, Dom? Any colors. Uh, it's all specified, white, red. How many colors? Uh, at least four or five. Black, white, gray. Black, red. green? Can they get it in green? They could get it in green. Okay. And we can actually green. custom color if they order about o over 150 50, uh, cans, because then uh, we can make... Uh, for teams. For teams. The product also dries pretty quick. So why are we putting a coat now on the uh, blade? Well, because maybe some people don't want to put a tape. Okay. And this is basically for ball hockey and roller hockey and street hockey. So the, uh, the player has the option of either applying it on the blade without the tape or the tape first and then the product? That's right. Over the tape. There you go. Now you don't have to tape this part here. You don't have to do this part. There you go. Like 
like I say, I put it here because you get a lot of high knocks with your sticks, the product will be able to protect your stick against high impact. The product dries pretty quick in warm temperatures. And it's got a grit finish, gives a better spin with the puck and the ball if you're playing ball hockey. It's very high impact resistant. We'll show you how high impact resistant later, but for now we'll just show you how it's applied. Basically two coats would be fine. This is the first coat. It's like a primer type of thing. And we're going to show how you all... How long does it dry, Dominic? Usually at room temperatures, 15 to 20 minutes the most. And you want to dry it fast, we'll show you how to do it fast too. Go dry in less than a minute. Using a hair dryer. Right? Exactly. And it's right here, we're ready to go. And you recommend three coats of two water coats. stick? Two, two coats. coats only? Two, yeah, yeah. Two coats is fine. Two thick coats or two thin coats? Well, the first coat would be uh, thin and the second coat would be uh, thick. A good thick coat. Yeah. Okay. Because you don't want to add too much weight on your stick. You know what I mean? So. Make sure it's hot enough. <laughs> I should dry it. We're talking about how long's it been now? Forty five seconds, at least a minute. Let's try it here. As you see, it's already dry. Let's put the second coat, and then we're on our way. Dries extremely fast. Well, dry, like I showed with the, with the, uh, the hair blower, it dries in uh, less than a uh, minute. You can actually dry it and then you could, you could start playing. Especially for roller hockey, there's no ice, no moisture. As you see here, see? That's where you get a lot of high knocks there with the stick. With other sticks. Yeah. Put a, a few here. That's where you get a lot of chips right at the, the toe. You could almost call it coat and go. <laughs> yeah, coat and go. <laughs> but we want to call it what a stick because that's what you want people to say when they finish applying the product. Okay. Same procedure. All right. Now we just applied two coats and we dried it with a hair dryer. As you see, it's nice and dry. You can see all the grit here. Now, when you, the puck hits it, it'll give it a better spin. And the stick is very stiff. That means you'll get a better shot. Harder shot, probably, because the stick will be uh, stiffer. And it'll probably last longer because it's high impact resistant. So here again. Here you're going to have a lot of high knocks. It sticks and it's going to be high impact resistant. We'll show you that with the other stick. Okay, now we're going to try apply the water stick liquid coating, stick uh, liquid stick uh, reinforcer, 
over the uh, tape stick and this is how we're going to do it. You tape the stick. Now I'm going to tape the stick here. Okay. Okay, here. Tape your stick. There we go. This is on a, on a new uh, graphite type of uh, hockey stick, right? Yeah, yeah. Not the wooden one. The market is for these sticks, not the wooden sticks anymore. We just taped the uh, liquid hockey tape with a stick on the blade. Now we're just going to coat it with the water stick. Black this time. So is it grit or smooth? Though? Yeah, of course. It's always grit the blade. You don't want you don't want the puck uh, to uh, skip. You want it to have some control. So we always have the grit. We have the uh, water stick for the uh, handle. That's in smooth. That will be in, in another video. We'll show how that's applied. But right now we're just going to show on the blade itself on the tape. Very easy. You don't have to put uh, the coat, the first coat, a heavy coat, very light coat. The second coat, you make it thicker. Basically, like a the first coat is like a primer. That's the thing. Very simple. And the most important, it doesn't add that much weight on your stick because this product is lightweight. Two coats is not much. Now, just for a fast drying, we're using a hair dryer. That's it. We'll dry in about a minute or less. All right, so the first coat has been done and it's been dried. Now we're going to place the second coat. Actually, it looks pretty good. Look at that. Wow. It's a, it's a work of art here. Beautiful. Okay, you want to put it here, you want to put it in the, in the toe area, yeah. yeah. Now we're going to turn it on the other side. Okay, let's see it's not been coated yet. Second coat you must, a little thicker than the first coat. First coat is like a primer, just light, this is thicker. And the beauty of it is that the tape is going to be protected and it's probably going to last as long as this stick. Uh, this tape is not going to come off ever again. I'm just going to chisel it out. It's waterproof. And it gives it a nice look too. There we go. Now we're going to be. At to speed up the drying, we're just using a. The hair blower, like hair I blower. said. All right. As you see, this is the fin finished job. Two coats. Now it's all dry. As you see, it's solid like a rock here. No moisture is going to go in. All right, in the next uh, section, we're going to show how high impact the product is on the uh, stick that's been uh, coated with uh, the uh, liquid uh, hockey tape with uh, in white. Oh, uh, stick. Yeah, but right now we're showing the finished job on a, a black tape. Of course, black tape with the coating black also. There you go, it's dry. Perfect, beautiful, it's ready to go.
Yeah, the hell. Just watch the camera. 